everybody, this is Snipe Girl here again, bringing you another Dragon Age Inquisition video. This time, I am bringing you the final Corypheus battle. Um, this is on Nightmare Mode. I actually find that uh, this guy is the easiest boss to kill in the entire game. I myself had uh, Morrigan do the drinking from the well, so she is going to become a dragon in this battle. Deal with those little guys down there, and then Corypheus will have run away, and you're going to follow him up the stairs to the left here, which I'm not doing, but you need to go left. When you get up here, you kind of just unload on Corypheus over here. There's really not uh, much to this part. I think I'm level 20 something here, so I find his, his barrier goes down pretty fast and. He doesn't really do much special in this part. You dare to touch an avatar of divinity. When you get him down enough, he'll run away again and you can go up these stairs. And up the stairs again and there's a supply cache in case you need it. I'd say heal up here just in case, but it's not really that necessary. Heal up and grab the cache. Go up some stairs again. You're gonna be facing the dragon now, I believe. I shall fear you from the very heavens. Enough! I will destroy you where you stand. You shall be dealt with harshly, Zephinda. Corypheus doesn't really do much here either. You get him down and he calls some minions. As soon as his health gets low enough though, his dragon is gonna show up. Enough! I will destroy you where you stand. So you get him down to about halfway and his dragon decides to join into the fight. I guess Morgan did all that she could. So now you have to take out the dragon, and Corypheus doesn't even bother helping out here. And as you can see, it's already half on its health, so there's not much that you gotta do. I saved uh, using the Mark of the Rift on this part of the battle. I like to stay closer to the side of its feet when I'm fighting it just to avoid it doing its drawing move.
do some potions on it just to make it uh, like, go a bit faster. There's the wing draw and move, but I'm already standing so close it doesn't do anything. better not to stand by the tail because he'll slap you with it. I just can't seem to get around to the side right now though. And the dragon's down and now it's time to go finish off Corypheus. Boil! Let the world be red to sunder! And again, run up some more stairs. Grant me power to finish this last right. And there's not much to this part of the battle with Griffiths either. This is the last phase. You got another supply cache, you can restock up on your potions again. And basically, this part you kind of want to just hide around behind the, the pillars every once in a while. He's really doing it. We have to stop him. He kind of has like a fire attack that he'll blaze out every once in a while. So I just like to hang by a pillar, but it really doesn't take long to take him down from here. That's the move there. He'll hide behind the pillar when he does that. And he'll go into the middle there every once in a while and charge up a big one. And when he's in the middle, you can shoot him a few times before you gotta get behind the pillar, but... Those are the only moves he does in this part. And he's in the middle, you can shoot him. And then go hide behind this pillar again before he unloads his move. But I think I'd kill him before he can even do the move. And that's it. You've beaten the game. Uh, I hope this guy helped you guys out. And um, like I said before, if you can like and subscribe, that'd be great. Thanks and catch you later. Ancient ones, I beseech you. If you exist, if you ever truly existed, aid me now. <laughs>